me. Now you were just telling me about the process of this fantastic artwork and I was telling you that I'm absolutely in love with it. Wonderful! <laughs> Isn't that sweet to hear? Look, but we were talking about process and generally when, when I'm trying to do, first of all, uh, on, on a big sheet of uh, paper like this, this is a printmaker's paper, um, I'll do a watercolor wash and um, then I'll do come in and do some individual brushwork in watercolor or with um, uh, with pen and ink uh, sometimes uh, acrylic inks because you know you can you can mess with them and they don't change but then there are other things underneath that I do want to change as I as I do con um, more and more layers but anyway that gives me something to have a dialogue with or even a fight and then I go over it with the with the soft pastel and this piece doesn't have um, any uh, pastel ground on it this is just the plain paper but that there was enough tooth left by you know some of the watercolor elements that I that the pastel really took to it but anyway um, so then I go through a process as I'm putting in the different layers of what can I sacrifice in the watercolor and what how do I how does the critical editor in me decide what I can do without and that's always the question I ask myself when I'm going over a nut you know a, an area of a work with a pastel because now I've got this new layer that has its own wants and needs and, and sometimes it wants to go over where that cool little area in the watercolor that I just spent an hour on I have to decide can I do without this and it has to be based not on how much work I've put into it, but does it work? And if it's not, if it's not singing to me at this point, it can go. <laughs> and I know that I can get singing out of the pastel. Um, and a lot of that has to do because I can, I'm actually using my hands instead of, you know, I'm not separated by a brush or a pen nib. I'm, I'm in there with my bare fingers and uh, you know I get dusty I get dirty and it's like three in the morning and I'm happy